presentation of TFNN. The Tom O'Brien Show is produced every business day. Tom takes your phone calls toll-free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Let's go to uh, Ben in San Jose. Ben, what's going on, brother? Hey, Tom. How you doing, man? I'm doing great, man. Yourself? I just wanted to thank you and your team and everything. I've been using your technique with the 10-minute charts, watching the VIX, and uh, just making a fortune here on the futures. Isn't it interesting? Interesting. <laughs> That's awesome, man. That's wonderful. Thanks, Tom. I appreciate okay, it. Okay, man. Have a great one. Have a safe one. Now, Tom O'Brien. <laughs> Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. We're kicking into August, and today's the first super moon, folks. And then on August 30th, we're going to have a super blue moon. And not until 20, 20, 2032 is going to be the next one. The last one was uh, also 2009. Yeah. Cultivate wisdom. You don't need to accumulate knowledge to become wise. Anyone can become wise. When you become wise, you respect your body, you respect your mind, and you respect your soul. When you become wise, your life is controlled by your heart, not your head. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 76, Nasdaq's down 39, S&P's off 9, gold contract down $26.80, trading at 1982 an ounce. We have silver down 51 cents, $24.45 an ounce. Light sweet crude down 48 cents, $81.32 a barrel. Notes and bonds, 10 year note down 16 ticks, trading at 110.28, the 30 year full point and a half at 123, and King Dollar, King Dollar up. 427 ticks trading 102.282. The euro is at 109. The yen is trading at 143. And the British pound is at 127 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of TFNN, folks, we get a, a real treat for you. Bottom line, tomorrow, our man, Mr. Larry Pezzavento, he's doing a live trading webinar it starts at 9 a.m goes to 2 p.m when i say live it's a live trading webinar goes for five hours and we're going to get my man larry presidento on right now to tell you all about it larry what's going on brother hey tom how are you doing pal i'm doing great yourself uh you know tom i look back at my career and all the things that i've done and i tell you doing this live stuff is what i really enjoy doing this will be my fifth one that we've done here in the last few years and, uh, and the Tigers and Tigresses love it too, Larry. Big yeah, time. we've had a lot of fun. We've had a lot of fun, but it's my chance to to really play in the World Series because this yep. show the folks either it works or it doesn't. You know, we've been pretty uh, on spot the last four sh shows we've done. Yes, this will be the fifth one. We've made money each time, and I think we'll do okay with the volatility that we're having today. And tomorrow, do with this uh, full moon that's uh, coming in right now. Come, it's it's literally coming in right now because it was 223. We won't see it till tonight, folks, but it was 223 in the eastern board anyway, right? Yeah. Yeah, what, what that blue moon means, folks, is it means there's two full moons in the same month. That doesn't happen very often. Right. So, in fact, when Elvis died, that we have one of those in August of 96. But uh, that was on the 16th of August. Anyway, what I'd like to talk about, of course, is all the things that we'll be covering. We've got uh, three PowerPoint presentations that we work on during the time we put on trades. The main thing what we're doing, Tom, is we're looking to make the $295 fee of the that the folks people pay we've done that each time yep and i think we'll be able to do it tomorrow but there's no guarantees of course if we don't do well they get to have the next one free but uh, i i'm really comfortable because i've got the eight things that we're looking at for for tomorrow a lot of different patterns and soybeans crude oil uh gosh just everything treasury bonds gold i mean s p 500 there's just a bunch of them that and the volatility is picking up nice. which is good volatility oh, is a goodness. trader's best yes. friend folks yeah oh yeah we love the volatility you know 400 up 400 down that's the kind of action that you love to see you don't want to see something going sideways right because there's nobody you know, nobody's interested in it but when they're going up and down 
that's when you want to be at the dance, and uh, we're going to bring the girl to the dance that we started with. That's A, B, C, D, and we're going to have some fun tomorrow, I believe. I really uh, feel comfortable about it, so I'm looking forward to it. And would you get, folks, okay, with this, okay, so the, the webinar is $2.95, but you're also going to get a full month of Larry's newsletter, Fibonacci 24 by 7, so it's a great value, okay? That's the bottom line. So come over to our website at TFNN. You're going to see it right under the featured content. Sign up now, you know, uh, particularly, please sign up now, folks, because, you know, if you go and wait till tomorrow morning, we just got to make sure we get you in the Tigers Den, particularly if you're not in Discord already. If you're not in Discord, folks, it's a buck. Get in Discord. Get in our Tigers Den because it's an amazing trading room. I mean, it's the best. It's the best one dollar you'll ever spend. Seriously. And we only charge a dollar so we don't get, you know, there's no scammers in there, man. So, you know. Just please go over there, you know, sign up. You're going to have a great workshop. It goes from 9 to 2 because that's when the action is. And uh, the bottom line is that uh, Larry's going to be throwing out some trades. And Larry's a patent recognition expert, so you're going to understand the patents. You're going to see the patents, and you're going to see how to trade the patents and how, where, to put your, where to go in, where to go out. And, of course, what, what does happen, because we have so many traders that are going to be in there anyway, as Larry has been talking about on the show, they're gonna, the traders themselves will be sending Larry over setups like, hey man, let's look at this one, let's look at this one. And that's what's so that's, cool. That's, that uh, is, that's cool. Yes. It is, it's, it's so great about the room itself. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That, you know, more eyes, let me tell you, more eyes work. There's no two ways about it. Amen to that. Amen. Hey, listen, thanks for having me for these last 17 years. I've loved it every minute. Can you believe it? 17 years, man. Oh, I can't believe it. That's I remember, scary. I remember in Clearwater when I met you, and it was February of 07. Dr. Earl uh, dropped us off in front of that hotel we were giving the seminar in, and uh, and it's been going on ever since. And we met in New York and Las Vegas. Yeah. And, oh, my God. I think, I think I solicited you in New York, right? It was a Traders Expo. Yes, it was. Yeah, 2004. Right. Right. Absolutely right. Right. Yeah. Unreal. Valentine's Day, as a matter of fact. I like it. Oh, that's and right. As a matter of fact, you still owe me $40 for dinner. I'll get that when I see you the next time. Right? Uh, that's a beautiful thing. I like that. <laughs> I like that $40 number. I like it. No, no, no doubt about it. Man. Hey, listen, has the weather calmed down? Anything out there? A little? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. A little bit. Uh, Good. No, no more major rainstorms. Uh, okay. The, the electricity ran for 36 hours straight. So we don't have another rain due until Monday or Tuesday, so we should be just fine. Okay, awesome. Okay, okay. well, listen. Hey, thanks, you, Tom. You have a great one, safe one. Of course, we look forward to the uh, show, uh, well, to the webinar tomorrow morning. Okay, thanks a lot, Okay, Tom. man. May God bless. Yeah, Thank you. Bye-bye. So, folks, you just come over to our website at TFNN. You're going to see it right under uh, featured content, live trading webinar, Ooh. trade what you see, 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. Again, it's $295. Larry's going to be trading live. He's going to set up all the patents. Well, the market sets up the patents, but you'll understand the patents. You'll see them. Um, you know, they're very clear setups when Larry, the, the charts that Larry's using. You'll see the angles. You'll see the geometry behind the angles. And listen, folks, <laughs> life's about geometry, period. So, so check it out. Um, and Dow. Let's see where the Dow is right now. We're going to have our man, Mr. Basil Chapman, coming up next with us. Yeah, Dow Industrials right now up 71, Nasdaq's down 40, S&P's off nine and a half. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. Currencies, commodities, and bond markets are as important as ever right now with how they're driving the volatility in equity markets across the globe, which is why it's a great time to try out Teddy Kegstat's Tiger Forex Report. Teddy Kegstat breaks down the Forex markets every Monday using his 30-plus years of experience as a trading veteran of futures, Forex, stocks, and options. Teddy releases his weekly Tiger Forex Report every Monday morning with coverage of all the major currency pairs, including the dollar index, the euro dollar, pound dollar, dollar Swiss, dollar yen as well as many more and he also has weekly coverage of the crude oil market and the 30-year t-bonds as they both influence forex markets tremendously when you sign up for the tiger forex report you also gain instant access to teddy's 60-minute webinar archive he just hosted forex strategies and fundamentals what is behind the tiger forex report for all the details and to start your 30-day tiger forex report subscription today visit the front page of tfnn.com tfnn educating investors are you ready to take your trading to the next level? 
Introducing Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, your key to successful active trading. Tom O'Brien, renowned for his expertise in the financial markets, has designed Market Insights to be your daily guide to profitable trades. Tom publishes his daily Market Insights newsletter every market day before the market open, along with updates when warranted. Stay ahead of the game with Tom's real-time analysis and trade recommendations delivered straight to your inbox. Whether you're a seasoned trader or just starting out, Market Insights provides the edge you need to navigate the markets with confidence. Ready to join the ranks of successful traders? Head over to TFNN.com and subscribe to Market Insights today. Don't miss out on this opportunity to supercharge your trading results. Market Insights comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee for all new subscribers, so you have nothing to risk. Don't miss out on this opportunity to revolutionize your trading game. Head over to TFNN.com right now to join thousands of traders who have already experienced the power of Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, firsthand. TFNN, educating investors. Everything in the universe is governed by the Fibonacci sequence. This mathematical principle is responsible for everything from the most aesthetically pleasing artwork to patterns in the stock market. To stay on top of stock patterns you can take advantage of, sign up for the Fibonacci 24-7 newsletter at TFNN.com. When you subscribe, you'll get a weekly report from veteran day trader Larry Pesavento on stocks you need to pay attention to. And you can trust Larry's analysis. After all, he's got 45 years experience as a day trader. Larry will also provide daily charts, videos, and data on the key markets that he's tracking. Expect notifications from Larry on market movement you need to act on at any time. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. Subscribe to the Fibonacci 24-7 newsletter today. TFNN.com. Educating investors. Call now, toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 66. You get the NASDAQ uh, down 42. S&P's off 9.5. Let's get over to our man, Mr. Basil Chapman, as we do each and every Tuesday at 20 past the hour. Don't forget, folks, Basil does an outstanding show here every trading day at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Also, it's a great newsletter, the opening call. Now, it's very easy to get the opening call. Folks, come over to our website at TFNN. You go under, under newsletters. You're going to see it right on the left-hand side. You can get the opening call for one month for $149.00. Six months for six ninety five, which is a savings of one hundred and ninety nine dollars at twenty two percent, and one year for eleven ninety five, which is a savings of five hundred and ninety three dollars at thirty three percent. Now they all come with a thirty day money back guarantee. So the bottom, and, and not only that, on top of that, what Basil has there, he's done many webinars. He's got twelve live webinars on there. So the bottom line, you're going to get some great webinars. You're going to get a great newsletter. And if it works for you, great. If it doesn't work for you, 29th day, just cancel it, no problem. Basil Chapman, what's going on? Hi, Tom. How are you? I'm doing great, man. Yourself? It was great to hear you with Larry. It's amazing. Uh, um, he's been trading forever. and uh, But, you know, it's we're always fascinated by his, uh, by his technique and what he discussed. But I don't know, his memory for detail, he'll say when I was with uh, Joe whatever on, uh, was it a Tuesday? I was a Tuesday, 1965. I know, man. Yeah. Seriously. <laughs> yeah. Seriously. I mean, it's fabulous. Anyway, it, it should it, be a wonderful it, workshop, that's for sure. No doubt, no doubt. So we're looking here at something that's quite fascinating for me. Okay. A week ago, when I spoke to you, you know, the, it feels like a lot's happened. But if you look, we're basically in a kind of a sideways move here. Here's the down on the left side. I'm showing the daily chart. Let's go back to last week. We were around about here at the Dow, 33,463. Here we are, 35, uh, 35, uh, Here we are, 35,624. Um, so the market's having a little difficulty. And if you've got you know, every time the market looks like it's about to decline sharply, you get a, a new, a, some kind of an earnings report today. It's Caterpillar spirals up really sharply and helps the Dow. The S&P is telling more of the story. But this is what I'm looking at. Remember when I spoke to you last week, I said I've got a, a, a technique. I call it my technical instruments of last resort. Just like the Federal Reserve is the bank of last resort. So this is my technical tool of last resort. This is where the nine-period moving average is over the 14-period moving average. And look how many times since uh, in April, 
when it crossed green, the uh, nine period moving average showed that the, the rally in the showed the rally in the Dow. The Dow then made a left side a high and then a right side high and then came down sharply. And then it crossed negative. Pink means that the nine is under the 14, means that you've got a deeper sell mode and you can keep going down. Then what happened is it flipped to positive in June. And once again, it got a left side and then a right side, this, this M shaped pattern. And the right side dropped sharply. And you look for certain that that green line would change to pink. And no, it didn't. It held green. And look where we are. Now we're at uh, the same situation where we made a left side high. Now you've got the right side high. What happens next is going to be very important. And you can see, the, for me at least, the importance of this nine period moving average holding so well says that a lot has to happen for this price. The gray, the gray line is the, is the closing price of the Dow for the price to come down very sharply to get that green to turn pink. That means you'd have to be down 35,000, uh, oh, probably at 34,800 to see it even getting close. So it says to me, a couple of things have to happen. You have to see, the, I, I've got this uh, technique that I call the dark news cloud cover. And uh, I'll just show this chart for a moment because there are a lot of things that I wanted to look at, but I'll show this. And we are now well above this whole resistance area since November of 2022. And what I call the dark news cloud cover is that like interest rates or um, geopolitical, whatever it is that the market will take seriously and decline, there's always something hovering. But all of a sudden, it looked like, oh, those things were dissipating. So the market, actually, the Dow itself, went above that uh, 30, I think it was 34,700 level. And now look where we are. So this means you've got a huge containment area. So I just wanted to put that into perspective. So I am anticipating that we're going to over the next, it might take a little while, either it's just really bad news. And you know, I, I don't want to go into it now, I'll do it on my show tomorrow at uh, 10 o'clock when I Eastern time when I do my uh, Tiger Technicians Hour. I did a little bit today. But you've got the TLT, actually, I should show it right now. The TLT, which is trading, Underneath that rectangle that I said was, oh, why is it not going? Oh, there it is. Uh, there it is, a TLT. Underneath, it's at 98.05 right now. That's bonds. Underneath the rectangle, which made this arch formation with like an M-shaped formation, now it's taken that out. So there's a chance. Yields go higher. You spoke about the dolly, and I'm always looking at uh, leg D and a peak D in the Chapman Wave methodology for turnarounds. Look, yes, the, the TLT daily is a peak D. Look how sharp we fell. There's a peak D all the way at 179 back in March of 2020. Now look at the dollar. It makes a, a, a trough D at the bottom, and it runs, and it's in the leg D to the upside. So that, and it's gone back into the rectangle. So that's the other thing. And look at crude oil. Crude oil is starting to kind of push the upper limit of this rectangle formation. So there are things sitting out there that say, hey, the market might start to worry about this in a moment. But when I when I look at the overall market, I have to wait for the to get a confirmation of really a sharper move down for all those those nine period moving averages in the daily charts to, to uh, turn down. And so far, they're holding quite well. So that's just kind of a warning to say, yes, the next move down could be a little bit longer and a little bit deeper, but we haven't actually started that yet. But in the meantime, for my subscribers, we were very fortunate. We had a stock I've spoken to you about this actually for a couple of months now. Sym Symbotic, uh, S-Y-M is the symbol. And um, it had a sudden spiral yesterday. It was up 50%. It's actually uh, up 200% of that big rally from the when we enter it. We don't have as much as I would like, but still it's fantastic to have a big move like Holy this. Holy cow. Look at that yeah, thing. Isn't that something? Huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, and, you know, it wasn't takeover or anything. I think this is purely on earnings, and there was uh, another company um, added to its allotment that it, it owns part of, of Symbotic. Some, Symbotic is in the end-to-end -end AI robotic warehouse automation systems. So these, these events are really important, and being able to identify sectors that have this kind of potential like AI. And I'm looking at others that I think if there is a pullback here, we've started to enter some positions that could 
be, I would say, I wouldn't, you can never tell whether it's market unrelated, but they're kind of under the radar, they're in their own world. So I think this is a time for selectivity, raise some cash. But at the same time, um, there are these positions that have, you know, potential to do really well. We've got, you know, we've still got this bots, which is the AI, um, the ETF, the Global X Robotics and AI ETF. Uh, that made a double top. It's pulling back, but it's actually holding very well. Um, so there are a lot of things that I would like to look at for the next part of the next move up in the in the market after we have some kind of consolidation. So and we're folks, trying to build up a portfolio for that. It's very easy to get Basil's newsletter. Come over to our website at TFNN. You're going to go into newsletters. You're going to see it right on the left-hand side. You hit that button and you are off to the races. Basil, you have a great night, a safe night. We look forward to the show tomorrow morning at 10 o'clock. Thank you very much, Tom. You too. Thank you. Have a great one. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. Attention traders, Larry Pesavento, the renowned trading mastermind, is holding an exclusive live trading event on Wednesday, August 2nd. From 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. Eastern Time, transform your trading skills with the real-time wisdom of a Wall Street veteran. Just $295 gets you a front row seat to this power-packed session, plus a month free of Larry's sought-after newsletter, Fibonacci 24-7 a $97 value. Elevate your strategies, decode the markets, and achieve your financial goals. Remember, this event will be archived for all attendees, and Larry only does a few of these a year. Don't miss this opportunity. Sign up today at TFNN.com. Secure your future and start trading smarter. TFNN, educating investors. The Gold Report. As a precious metal, gold is still king. It continues to hold the most effective safe haven and hedging properties across the global major trading hubs of the London OTC market, the U.S. futures market, and the Shanghai Gold Exchange. The Gold Report. Tom O'Brien publishes his weekly gold report every Monday morning for subscribers, consisting of coverage of the XAU, HUI, GDX, the dollar, bonds, the South African Rand, as well as 25 different mining equities with specific buy-sell recommendations. The Gold Report. New subscribers get a 30-day money-back guarantee so you have nothing to risk. Subscribe to Tom O'Brien's Gold Report newsletter now at TFNN.com. Sharpening your skills as an investor is like getting better at playing a musical instrument. You have to practice, sure, but you also need excellent instruction from experts. At TFNN, you'll get advice and guidance from the authority in technical market analysis. And it's not just dry, tedious text either. TFNN airs live financial content streamed live on TFNN.com and TFNN's YouTube channel with Tiger TV. Live every market day from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern. For free, each host is an experienced trader and gives their take on the market while taking calls and questions live from around the world. From the moment the market opens until the closing bell sounds, Tiger TV has eight different shows with expert hosts to help you make the right moves with your money. Watch online at TFNN.com or on TFNN's YouTube channel and become the investor you were born to be. TFNN, educating investors. Don't forget, you can listen to TFNN live on your mobile device 24 hours per day. Go to TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. That's TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrials right now trading up uh, 56. You get the NASDAQ uh, down 48, S&Ps down 11. Let's go take a look at that Caterpillar because this is all but saying that this commodity market is going to run, man. I mean, look at this move, $22. And then if we take it and you put it on a monthly, you're going to see that it just broke everything. It big consolidation, consolidated, you know, two months ago, it stopped pushing high with volume. And this is quite a move, man. There's no two ways about it. That's, that's a monster move. And they did, let's take a look at what they did here. 
the cool thing about Caterpillar, folks, is that the, the lead time, you know, is a big number. Oh, this is interesting, though. They took in $16.5 billion top line, $5.67 bottom line. But it looks like that's going to be the peak. Now, this is interesting, man. So I'm not quite sure, you know, I have to dig into it as to why this would be the peak. Because you can see these numbers, 15.6, it goes down a billion dollars next quarter. But then, well, then the quarter after that, it comes right back up 1.4 billion. So big numbers, man. There's no doubt about that. Some of the other higher volume equities that we have out here today is that you have, let's see, so we got Tesla's down six bucks. You got uh, Uber off 290. Uber come out with numbers. The, the thing that's amazing about Uber is that watch these numbers and the context of, you know, they're still, they have 32,000 employees. So they took in 9.2 billion. And, oh, that's interesting. It's saying they made 18 cents. Okay, I thought they were still in loss. Okay, so they, they, they made money. This is a first. That's, this is the first quarter they made money. That's pretty amazing, man. Hmm. I was listening to the interview this morning. They have something like 138 million customers, folks. 138 million, yeah. You talk about a monster, that is about, a, that's huge. Uh, we have, let's see, you have, uh, let's go do this. Let's go into the NDX first. Al, you sure that, uh, Tim's calling me. What's happening? Is this, you can't get through? I know. We heard you. Try, just try again, all right? Just, okay, thanks. Sorry about that, folks. I, I heard the phone. Al, he's trying to call. Just get that phone clear, please, all right? Sorry about that, folks. So uh, inside the NDX 100, you get CrowdStrike up 3%. There we go. You got him, Al? It's all that matters. It's working now. It's a beautiful thing. Let's get over to our man, Mr. Tim Wood, folks, as, as we do every Tuesday at the 3.30 hour. Tim Wood, what's going on, brother? Well, everything seems to be okay here. Uh, we we yeah. sold our long position. I got an indicator that um, I've sent you over a couple of charts. I don't know how many we'll be able to get through. No, I know uh, you got you got you you're letting us in on something new. Let's take a take a look at that. Is that the 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 which one you want to start with? All right, chart one. Yeah, um, and it's the SPX tilt ratio. Uh, Tilt is the uh, twenty-year Treasury yes, bond. Yes, I know. And, okay. And, uh, so anyhow, I, I watch what that ratio does, and it really markets um, they, they're balanced. If they get out of balance, they come back to the norm, and yes. that's either up or down. Uh, so when this ratio gets out of balance, you know the RS. Well, on the upside, the RSI gets above seventy. Normally, you got a kind of a short-term top. Uh, this is on the ratio, the RSI for the SPX TLT ratio. Yes. And so I, uh, you can go back further, but I marked the times, uh, the second window up from the bottom is the daily S and PX. Yep. And I marked the times when the uh, RSI of the SPX uh, TLT ratio got above seventy. Okay. And so it does, uh, it does a pretty well, you know, job of, of picking out just short term highs or not. Long term highs, but that's what I'm kind of looking for here. I, I'm thinking we're we're entering into some sort of a high area, and the VIX is not getting a lot of information. It's relatively staying low, and it's not doing any great divergences, uh, which is kind of a, my main tool. Yes. So this is a little bit shorter term time frame, but the RSI when I printed this uh, chart this morning was uh, was 82. Okay. And that's pretty darn high. So. What that says to me, uh, at least on the SPX, the upside is limited here because okay. you never get the RSI up to 90. It, you know, between 70 and 80 it usually kind of peaks out, and the um, and you start getting a, at least a sideways move, not a, a short-term top yes. on the SPX. So, which well, kind of um, which what we've been doing here for a bit. I mean, you thought we were going to flip around into consolidation. It looks like we've just been going sideways at highs, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, so far, we're, yeah, this chart suggests, like, the upside is limited. 
Um, so I guess we could move sideways. So out of two, three, uh, you know, three things can happen. You can either go up sideways or down. Yes. Well, this kind of takes uh, this uh, the upside, in my opinion, out out of the equation. Can I'm we move sideways? Okay. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Uh, so um, so I anyhow, mean, just it's kind of a chart that. I, I watch when the short-term picture gets a little fuzzy. I kind of look at this, see what it says. This is one of and these you have says, in your back pocket. I'm glad we cut it out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's 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 so, so anyhow. So let's actually flip back to uh, chart number two. Okay. And and this uh, anyhow the the big chart in the middle there is the VIX. Yes. And if you notice the VIX since basically mid June. It's pretty much going sideways, and the SPX is going up. So there's divergence, and the top window is the SPX VIX ratio. Um, so it 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 kind of smooths out things a little better, so you don't, you don't see all this jittery stuff going on. Right, and it's kind of moved sideways. It did kind of make a higher high, but barely here a week or so ago. But it's not getting real bearish. I mean, it can move sideways, I guess, forever. And the SPs could still move up, but what you want to happen for a bearish sign is the VIX to move up, and while the S and P's is moving up, and that's what usually happens right. at tops. Um, the S and P's moving up, and the VIX is still kind of moving sideways, so it leans bearish, but not. You know, I wouldn't bet on. Put it this way. Uh, I wouldn't bet a short here, even though it may work out. No, I'm with uh, you. Until it's, it's, that, that VIX starts going up along with the S and P's, then uh, then I'd get uh, start looking a little bit more bearish. So yeah, and it's getting uh, through this it, window dressing too, probably right. You know, beginning of the month. It's yeah, it, yep. It, yeah, that's a good point. You know, it's uh, sometimes these you know tops they ring a bell at the bottom, and yes. everything just blows out, and you get a bottom and reverses and. And if you're lucky to buy into that bottom, you know, because a lot of times it never looks back. Right. On tops, it's just almost the opposite. They go up there and they make a high, they make a higher high. They and, do. And sometimes these tops can take weeks to form. No, no doubt. And, there's, uh, there's, there's no doubt and, about that, man. It's just pretty wild when you think about it, right? Yeah, stay right there, Tim. We're going to take a short break right. and then we're going to come right back, folks. We have the Dow Industrials right now. Uh, trading uh, down, uh, trading up 52. Nasdaq is down 47. S&Ps are up 12. You can contact Tim every trading day, folks, at Ord, O R D, dash Oracle, O R C L E dot com. That's Ord dash Oracle dot com. Tim and I are going to be coming right back, folks. Stay right there. If you're looking for potential trading setups in the stock market, then Rocket Equities and Options Report is a newsletter you should try. Tommy O'Brien delivers options and equity trades when the markets present them using a combination of fundamentals and technicals. Sign up for Rocket Equities and Options Report today with a 30-day money-back guarantee so you have nothing to risk. For all the details and to start your subscription today, visit the front page of TFNN.com. TFNN, educating investors. You might think that if you want to be successful at trading in the stock market, you're going to need a crystal ball. After all, it's impossible to predict the future, right? Like any endeavor in life, before you decide it's impossible, get some advice from the experts. You might find that it's not so impossible after all. For daily market overviews that give you direction on the key indices, selective stocks, and commodities, subscribe to the opening call newsletter at TFNN.com. The opening call newsletter is written by Basil Chapman, creator of the trading methodology known as the Chapman Wave. The Chapman Wave up-down sequence gives you an edge in identifying price turns, finding the peaks and valleys in stock prices. Get the opening call newsletter by Basil Chapman in your inbox every day. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know, and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. TFNN.com, educating investors. Biotech is booming, but for how long? Whether you think the biotech bull has room to run or has run its course, trade LABU or LABD. Direction's daily S&P Biotech three times bull and bear ETFs. Visit directioninvestments.com slash biotech today. 
An investor should consider the investment objectives, risks, charges, and expenses of the direction shares carefully before investing. The prospectus and summary prospectus contain this and other information about direction shares. To obtain a prospectus or summary prospectus, please contact direction shares at 866-476-7523. The prospectus or summary prospectus should be read carefully before investing. An investment in the funds is subject to risk, including the possible loss of principal. The funds are designed to be utilized only by sophisticated investors such as traders and active investors. Distributor Foresight Fund Services, LLC. TFNN has launched the Tiger's Den, hosted at Discord. TFNN has been educating traders for more than 20 years with live programming hosted by a variety of professional traders during market hours. The Tiger's Den, available to all tigers and tigresses for just $1 for the year. There's no cash or added costs when you join our community of traders. Sign up today and become a part of this educational community of traders. Just visit the front page of TFNN.com. This program is brought to you by Vista Gold, traded on the NYSE American and TSX under the symbol VGZ. Tom O'Brien. Welcome back, folks. Tim Moore, Tom O'Brien. We do appreciate you growling and prowling us out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 33, Nasdaq's down 56, SPs are up 15 and a half. We're talking with Tim, and the chart that I have up right now, Tim, is the uh, VIX and the SPY. Right. Actually, I wanted to talk about uh, last Thursday, we had a uh, bearish engulfing pattern drawn uh, on the um, SPYs. In other words, uh, you engulfed about, uh, it looks like about three, four of the previous days. It was a bearish candlestick pattern. Yes. And if, if you notice, you had kind of high volume that day, at least on the um, yep. uh, yep. SPYs. And what I found out over the years, a lot, you know, high volume highs and actually high volume lows. Uh, majority of the time, not 100% of the time, but majority of the time are tested. Right. And uh, so I'm, I'm thinking there's a good chance we could test last Thursday's high. Right. And if we test last Thursday's high and, he, and, he, and the VIX goes up with it, uh, then that could really line up for a decent uh, sell signal. I mean, a reliable sell signal. I'm not saying the market's going to cry to the No, floor, no, no, which is sweet. No, I get it. I mean, because you remember... <laughs> Those uh, in uh, what is those inverted hammers? The um, they love getting tested, man. They love getting tested after it, you get an inverted hammer at the top, and then it comes down, then it comes back up. Especially when it has volume in it. I know. I can see that right. that that high volume high at ninety ninety five ninety two million, and we you can yeah. go all the way back. I can go back six more. Well, at one hundred and four million. Let's see. That was in uh, what was that June. Yeah, June 104 million. The, the, the last couple highs had some good volume, but we hadn't had something like that for a long time, man. Yeah, interesting. Right. Yeah. No doubt. So, so I'm thinking, you know, in the market, you know, if you're looking at interday stuff here, uh, yesterday the trend closed at 1.25. Anything above 1.2, short term bullish. And as we're talking here, I got a trend of uh, 1.2. So you had a couple of days of bullish trend, you know, it's, it's building kind of a, uh, a little bit of energy, I guess. You It's a little bit of panic here, not a lot. You know, okay. we're at a high, and, and uh, so I, I'm thinking there's a good chance we possibly test that last Thursday's high. And that's where the, the rubber meets the road, I guess. Yes. Either we bust through that, which I don't think we, I mean, we may close above it. But anyway, that's where I'm, I'm thinking that's the key area, which is rump uh, on the SPX, I think it's 4607. So right around that 4,600 area a little, uh, 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 is a real key area, which is also the highs of, two th or, uh, of February, March, and April of 2022. That's where those highs lie. Right. So there's quite a bit of stuff right there that um, may may uh, line up pretty well. You know, when will you hit it? I don't know. You know, a lot of times these signals come on Fridays, I found out. So they make your whole weekend miserable because you're wondering <laughs> if you're going to be right or wrong come Monday. So, I love it. Uh, okay, so yeah, let's so, – want to go to the next shot? Yeah, we can. Okay. We can. So um, this, they're actually the, – chart three and four are actually the same, the same chart. And uh, let me – there's just kind of a, a little review here. This is the uh, – um, 
is you know, it's a 50 day average. You know, the bottom windows I'm looking at is which is a 50 day average right. of the up down volume percent. So it it's a little bit a longer term indicator. It's not like that. We've been looking at the 18 day average of the up down volume advanced client indicators, which is on a buy signal on the short term. This is a bigger longer term indicator, and and it looks like about June of this year. I, I didn't write down the date. Yeah, you know, when that indicator uh, up down volume advanced climb gets below minus twenty, usually your exhaustion move to the downside. And if your exhaustion move downside, in other words, you're you're blowing out uh, to the downside and the bottom. And every time we get down to minus twenty, uh, this chart goes back to two thousand ten. It went back up to plus twenty. And right. I did it every time. And so we're still below, uh, or we did hit below minus 20, but so far we have not hit above, actually it's, uh, excuse me, it's above minus 12, or plus 12. If you get a buy signal, it's below minus 20, yep. and a sell signal uh, gets above plus 12. And so the buy signals are all circled in blue, and the red circles are all, uh, the sell signals are all circled in red. And so every time you got a blue circle, you went up into a red circle at yes. some point. So that's what we're kind of looking for. And we're around minus two right now, so we've got quite a ways to go. I know we get it's to pretty. 12. It's pretty cool, Tim, that we've got, we got through. We made it through last Thursday because last Thursday was a rough day in the gold market, right? And then today, yeah. you know, last Thursday, what happened is that the, you know, we went from twenty twenty two to nineteen eighty one. And, you know, today we went to from, you know, bottom line is that we went from, what, uh, 2004 to 1978. We're testing last Thursdays. And we are, the cool thing is that you're actually testing Thursdays and uh, the 12th of July, you know. So it's kind of cool that that um, ratio is still holding up with a couple tough days in here. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm thinking the market's going to hold up here. Right. Uh, you know, we're, right. we're we're just screwing around building, you know, building some energy for the next move. But uh, so, you know, this gave a, we should actually get to plus 12 at some point between now and October is what I'm thinking. Right. But, you know, it, it gave a, a you know, a, a good uh, buy signal. And in my opinion, on an intermediate scale, we're still on a buy signal. Yes. Now, if you flip to the, the next chart, which is chart four. OK. Now, you know, this is the same chart. And it's just, it's everything's same about it. What I did notice uh, on the bottom window there, to really have strong uptrends, uh, the needs to stay above uh, zero. Okay. And right now we're about we're right at zero minus two on this indicator. I see. I see. And all see. the blue areas are times when those indicators stayed above zero. Okay. So zero is when the strong part of the rally begins. Yep. So. Uh, even though we bounced here a little bit, the strongest part, in my opinion, still lies in front of us. Right. Because when those, because uh, when the uh, uh, advance or the up down volume, when actually even the advance decline get above zero, that strengthened the market. That's saying more stocks are going up on heavier volume. That's what that says. And Tim, and so is that though, bottom on a daily? Yeah, these are on daily. Cool. Okay, so I can see it. So last Thursday, you were below it. Friday, above it. You jumped above it yesterday. You come below it today. Cool. I got it. Okay, cool. Yep. Um, well, this this is on a daily chart. They only update this, so we don't know if this is going to be above minus two today. Uh, yeah, this is no, a, it's going to be a below daily it probably, chart. Right? Yeah. I'm not, not sure what what you're looking at here. Are we looking at the... Um, I was looking at the bottom, bottom chart. So the bottom chart looks like it's going to be below it again today. But when we what we had done is that yesterday we jumped above it, which would make sense. Was it yesterday? Hold on one second. Let me look at this. No, nah, it, it's... Yeah. Um, this is a daily chart. So... Uh, well, I can see... Was a, it, wasn't it above it yesterday? No. Where the circle is? No. No? no? Okay. No. Okay. Yeah, it's still below it, but barely. I see. You know, the the what, what I wanted to point out here is when those that went uh, well, I'll have, have a shaded there is all bl in blue. Yes. And and that's when the parse the strongest part of the rally begins when those two indicators are above 
zero. They stay so above I'm it. I get still it. Lies in front of us. Last month it was there. I know. I hear your your radio. Your I music, get it. So. Well, listen. This is always a pleasure. I look forward to speaking to you on Thursday, Tim. All right. Thanks a lot. Have a great one, man. Have a safe one. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. Are you ready to take your trading to the next level? Introducing Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, your key to successful active trading. Tom O'Brien, renowned for his expertise in the financial markets, has designed Market Insights to be your daily guide to profitable trades. Tom publishes his daily Market Insights newsletter every market day before the market open, along with updates when warranted. Stay ahead of the game with Tom's real-time analysis and trade recommendations delivered straight to your inbox. Whether you're a seasoned trader or just starting out, Market Insights provides the edge you need to navigate the markets with confidence. Ready to join the ranks of successful traders? Head over to TFNN.com and subscribe to Market Insights today. Don't miss out on this opportunity to supercharge your trading results. Market Insights comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee for all new subscribers, so you have nothing to risk. Don't miss out on this opportunity to revolutionize your trading game. Head over to TFNN.com right now to join the thousands of traders who have already experienced the power of Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, firsthand. TFNN, educating investors. You might think that if you want to be successful at trading in the stock market, you're going to need a crystal ball. After all, it's impossible to predict the future, right? Like any endeavor in life, before you decide it's impossible, get some advice from the experts. You might find that it's not so impossible after all. For daily market overviews that give you direction on the key indices, selective stocks, and commodities, subscribe to the opening call newsletter at TFNN.com. The opening call newsletter is written by Basil Chapman, creator of the trading methodology known as the Chapman Wave. The Chapman Wave up-down sequence gives you an edge in identifying price turns, finding the peaks and valleys in stock prices. Get the opening call newsletter by Basil Chapman in your inbox every day. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know, and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. TFNN.com, educating investors. Everything in the universe is governed by the Fibonacci sequence. This mathematical principle is responsible for everything from the most aesthetically pleasing artwork to patterns in the stock market. To stay on top of stock patterns you can take advantage of, sign up for the Fibonacci 24-7 newsletter at TFNN.com. When you subscribe, you'll get a weekly report from veteran day trader Larry Pesavento on stocks you need to pay attention to. And you can trust Larry's analysis. After all, he's got 45 years experience as a day trader. Larry will also provide daily charts, videos, and data on the key markets that he's tracking. Expect notifications from Larry on market movement you need to act on at any time. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. Subscribe to the Fibonacci 24-7 newsletter today. TFNN.com, educating investors. Don't forget, you can listen to TFNN live on your mobile device 24 hours per day. Go to TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. That's TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. Welcome back, folks. The Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 82. You got the NASDAQ down 43. S&Ps are off 9. Folks, don't forget about our man, Mr. Larry Pezzavento. So tomorrow morning, Larry's going to be doing a live trading workshop. He's Larry's a patent recognition expert. Bottom line, he's going to go from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. The cost is right under... A featured content, the cost is $295. What you get for that, folks, is not only a great workshop, you can understand the patents, and then you get Fibonacci 24-7 for a full month, which is a $97 value. So if you're not in our Discord room yet, our Tiger Trading Room, um, you should go in there anyway. It's only a dollar, folks, okay? And it's a great trading room. We charge a dollar so that, you know, you can't have, get any scammers in there. We already know, we know who's in there, which is a really cool thing. And... If you are coming to Larry's workshop, okay, it's a lot easier if you're already signed up in that room because we have a lot of different rooms in there. It takes two seconds to get you in. But the bottom line is, is that please don't, you know, come in in the morning and call us at, you know, two minutes at nine to want to get in at nine, okay? You can do that, but we'd much rather that you get over there, set it up so you're all set to go because as Larry's throw, throwing these trades off, bottom line, you want to be in the middle of those trades. That's what it comes down to. 
the market out here, bottom line is that, uh, you know, you're at the highs. That's that's the bottom line. And that, that high volume high in the S&P still wants to get tagged, man. I don't know how it's going to get tagged, but it wants to get tagged. You know, we're right next to it. You can see we've been in the same place, actually. Let's, let's see, five. Yeah, 10 days, 10 trading days here. We've been in the same range. But you can see this is sticking out like a sore thumb. It wasn't bearish engulfing, no doubt, but it's a high volume bearish engulfing. So we're at 456, 450. 944 is the number. Now we go to the Qs. The Qs are set up a little bit differently because when we did have that high volume come into the Qs, it didn't even get to its high. But the high volume is out there at 38471. And what you do have today is this. The Qs did reject lower price at 380. You're at 382. So that's saying that, hey, tomorrow might be the day that's going to go after this baby. Always remember, folks, the bear can claw your heart out, the bull can run you over, and thank God, there's always another trade. Have a great night, a safe night, folks. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning. Kicks us off 9 a.m. Go get him, folks.